channel welcome back to another video my name is Haley and I'm currently in Toronto and I'm moving to London it's been a long day guys I've been so I'm like emotionally drained let's have a little chit chat actually I'm emotionally drained we woke up at like six o'clock this morning because my flight was at 11 um, or like 12 ish we, had, we were like two hours away so I had to get up get ready and then leave but like I cried in the car and then I like calmed myself down and I was like it's fine like we're gonna be fine and then I got to the hospital not the hospital <laughs> I got to the airport with my mom my brother and my boyfriend and I lost it when I had to go through security which I feel like that's just like expected like no one expected me not to cry you shouldn't expect me not to cry I sobbed but I'm in Toronto now. My layover has been going on now for maybe like six hours and I still have like three hours left. I think right now it's like 8.30. That's why I think it's like nine something and I leave at 11. So about two hours actually. I'm sorry to get there. Once I get there, I'm gonna go to my Airbnb and Hello, like probably- this okay. is the final boarding call for Anyways, okay. once I get to London, I'm meeting someone who is like from back home and she's gonna help me kind of get around and find my Airbnb and rented a room for the next three and a half weeks in London. And then I'm gonna move to Brighton, which is like where my school is and like when I start school. But while I'm in London, I'm like super excited to get some shopping done for my apartment. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me to do all of that. But I think tomorrow I'm just gonna do a good like food shop and beauty shop but you guys will see all of that later in this vlog thank you guys so much for watching i hope you love this vlog i'm exhausted so i'm gonna kind of just rest right now before our flight and i will see you guys in london I'm staying in a shared apartment like in a room and I'm right here and then this is like my neighbor's door so like my door his door I'm so tired I want to go to bed but I talked to some people and they said it's better if I stay awake right now and go to bed a little bit later so I'm gonna try to hold out it's raining right now let me show you actually my little bedroom this is literally it honestly it's not that much side table a bed and then a clothing rack which i'm just gonna like oh and then like my wi-fi but i'm literally just gonna lay out my suitcases over here or maybe over there i don't know i'm gonna lay them out and kind of see i haven't like oh i need to not put that on the bed that's gross and then this is the door let me show you this is my room and then that's his room literally right there so as you can see i am living in very close quarters with other people. It's raining right now, so I'm not gonna be able to go out, but I wanna go out and get some, well, first of all, I need to get a SIM card and a new number. So I'm gonna go get a SIM card, a number, some food, some bath products, some beauty products, and then I'm gonna come back, take a bath, and then literally relax my little ass off and then see like if they have any meals. Oh. Guys, it's raining. It was just pouring down a bit harder and it was so peaceful, so beautiful. Like, tell me that's not just like picturesque London. I'm leaving for the supermarket or for Tesco right now because I have to pick up a few things 
but I just pulled out my tote bag. So I'm gonna check my wallet with this and then my mask and some hand sanitizer to just prepare for like going out because I'm kind of stressed. This is just the Touchland Power Mist and the scent Beach Cocoa Scented. Y'all, this smells absolutely insane. These are my favorite hand sanitizer. If you guys are looking for a good quality hand sanitizer, I will link this one down below because they just came out with a scent and I'm obsessed with it. So we're gonna take this, just my little mask, my wallet. I feel like I should have brought more accessories with me like to move, but I didn't. So we're just gonna take those few things because I need space for like actual groceries in my bag and we're gonna head out. goodies that I needed let's get into it also I need an adapter my phone nothing can charge because I don't have an adapter and I went to Tesco and they didn't have it they also didn't have a sim card so I'm like I literally don't know what to do um but we're gonna worry about that tomorrow and not tonight okay so first thing I got was a loofah it's already stopping wet but a loofah because I need a shower with one got some toothpaste and a toothbrush i literally forgot all of my beauty like kitchen stuff so i had to buy some more i bought some ibuprofen and some paracetamol because i literally am in pain 24 7. it's not good but anyway i've got some oranges i got some easy peel ones because i was like i'm gonna keep everything in my room so i don't have to like share with other people then i got some bread some whole earth smooth peanut butter i was shocked to see this and for the price it was only like three pounds my day one dark chocolate digestive if you guys like the milk chocolate go away i like the dark chocolate got some avocados i'm gonna try this shampoo and conditioner just this aussie brand I'm almost positive i tried this when i studied abroad but i literally don't know then I got two of these two pack of like steamed basmati rice. I'm gonna do one of these tonight with, I'm meant to make it some vegetables. Anyways, I'm gonna do one of these tonight, probably with like avocado toast. Not avocado toast, a piece of toast or a piece of bread. I don't know. I got some salt, some seasonal wash. This is just the simple moisturizing face wash. And lastly, I got some Dub Nourishing Body Wash because I literally need it so that's everything I got I think I'm gonna end the vlog here actually because I'm gonna like shower and just try to get cozy and try to charge my phone um but yeah thank you guys for watching my day one my what is this moving vlog I am so excited to like take you guys on this journey with me stay tuned for my first week I think I'm gonna film the rest of this week and like show you guys my first week of settling in Maybe going and doing a little bit more shopping and figuring stuff out. But that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Follow me on my socials, which will all be linked down below as well. I'm definitely more like in the moment on there so you guys can see a very like realistic timeline of what's happening with me here, um, with my apartment, with everything like that. But that is it for today's video and I will see you guys next time. Bye.